Portfolio Programme and Project Management, otherwise known as P3M, is a method that organisations can use to select, prioritise and manage their total work and supports decision-making by ensuring resources are allocated to projects that provide the greatest value. A workforce with the right P3M skills enables the delivery of smooth transitions and successful change. Through consultation with the NHS, a set of competence-based roles for P3M staff has been developed which provides a standard level of competence for a range of project and programme roles. The P3M Competence Assessment Tool has been created to assess the specific skills and experience required for the roles, which provides a baseline for staff to assess themselves against a standard. The tool uses the Association for Project Management Competencies, as well as other standards, and self-assessment is supported by the provision of evidence to demonstrate knowledge and experience appropriate to the role. The tool's purpose is to help individuals plan their personal and professional development and can form part of an informal appraisal process. The benefits of using the tool include focused learning and development, self-assessment against specific P3M competencies appropriate to the role and level, objective approval by line management, this short video will give you an overview of how to use the tool, but for more detailed instruction, please click on the User Guide button on the home screen. Click on and print the scoring guide for descriptions and to complete the assessment. Click on Begin Assessment and complete personal details before selecting the appropriate role which fits your current work. You'll be taken to the assessment screen. Hover over the competence to see an overview description and click on the number code to see more detail on the competence and a variety of indicators. Complete the knowledge and experience scores for each competence according to the levels in the scoring guide and complete the evidence column to demonstrate your competence. Once complete, the overall level will be calculated for your scores. Click on the dashboard to view your assessment compared to the NHS standard levels of competence. Where your self-assessed level is equal to the standard, you will see a green tick. This means you are considered competent for the role. If you are above the standard, you will see a gold star. You may consider becoming a mentor or buddy for others who are not as experienced in that competence. If the level is below the standard, you will see a red flag and suggested areas of learning and development will be indicated in the dashboard. The learning and development link will take you to a catalogue of materials, training and experiential learning, which will give you some suggestions for building this area of competence. It has been developed in collaboration with the NHS and will be regularly reviewed and updated. If you are using this assessment as part of your appraisal or PDR process, once you have completed your assessment, send a copy to your reporting manager who will then review your scores and assess the evidence. This will provide you with a starting point for your personal development discussion. By assessing everyone in the team, overall skills gaps will be highlighted and appropriate learning and development can be organised, saving time and cost, focusing learning on specific needs. You are now ready to begin your assessment. Remember to regularly save your work and if you need any further guidance, please read the full user guide. To view the generic role descriptions or to explore the learning and development catalogue, please access the P3M Resource Centre at www.connectingforhealth.nhs.uk slash p3m.